What is going on guys welcome back in this video today we're going to learn how to solve partial differential equations in Python so let us get right into it. Alright so another math focused tutorial we're going to learn how to solve partial differential equations in Python today and as always I'm not going to focus too much on the mathematics I'm a computer scientist a programmer not a mathematician I want to focus on how to actually solve them in Python using code and the reason I think this is a useful tutorial is because the ways to solve partial differential equations without doing it yourself by hand um, I didn't find so many ways to do that. Wolfram Alpha doesn't seem to be very capable of doing that. And the software, the only software that I found that uh, does that maple is actually costing money. So it's not free. Of course, here you can just enter a partial differential equation, you can use PD solve, you can also use it with an initial condition, uh, which unfortunately, we're not going to be able to do in this video today, I tried to make it work, but just doing a simple solve on the equation and an initial condition to get the exact solution doesn't work as easily in Python, or at least with the SymPy package, we would probably have to implement some mechanism uh, ourselves there, but we can get at least to the general solution quite quickly. And we can do that for free using the Python package SymPy, which is for symbolic mathematics. So you can open up your terminal, install SymPy by using pip, so pip3 install SymPy. And then we can go ahead and solve this uh, partial differential equation here. In this case, it's x times uh, the partial derivative of u with respect to x minus three, uh, three times y times the partial derivative of u with respect to y is equal to 2x squared times u. And we also have this initial condition u um, of t and t squared is equal to e to the power of t squared. So that is basically it. And as I said, we're not going to be able to do that easily, we have to do it by hand, or we have to code some mechanism around it. But the general solution can be uh, can be found easily, which is very useful if you're studying for a calculus exam. And you want to quickly check your solutions and you don't want to spend money on software. So we're going to say here import simpy as sp, and we're going to define our partial or actually, first of all, we need to define the symbols, we going to find the symbols first, x and y are our symbols or our variables. Uh, so we need to define them as sp symbols, x and y. And then we also define our function u, sp function. It's the function u, which is a function of x and y. So this is how we do that. And then we just have to define our partial differential equation by saying it's an SP equation. And here we pass the left side and the right side. So we say x times diff or actually SP diff um, of u with respect to x minus three times y. And since we define these now as symbols and functions, multiplying and subtracting and so on is done symbolically and not as a calculation. Uh, so three times y times sp diff of u with respect to y. And then we use a comma to say the right hand side is two times x squared times u. All right, so this is our equation. And now getting a solution is very, very easy. We just say solution equals and then sp uh, PD solve, same name as in maple, PDE. And then we can look at the solution. And you can see, this is our general solution, we can also only get the right hand side solution dot RHS. And you can see that basically the solution is e to the power of x to the power of two. So e to the power uh, e to the power of x squared, um, times some function that takes x to the power of three and y is input. Now, as I said, we don't have an easy way, or at least I don't know one. If you know one, let me know in the comment section down below, I would be very interested in that. Uh, but as far as I know, there's not an easy way to just go ahead, plug in an initial condition, especially not one where you have a placeholder like t, um, or a variable like t, and easily find the exact solution. So from here, you could go ahead and try to substitute x and y with t and t squared, which I try to do, I have a bunch of code written that I don't think is very useful to show you guys. But what you can do is you can just keep going here yourself. So what you see is that the um, condition here says if you plug in t and t squared, you get e t squared. So that's basically just e x squared. 
um, and yeah, basically you can see that then the function of of uh, x to the power three and y is equal to nothing. So to it's basically just one, um, and yeah, that basically leaves us with with this. But this is manually, so this is not automated in Python. But to me, this is a very useful thing again because I didn't find um, a lot of software that can solve partial differential equations easily. The only one that can do it very good or very well is Maple, but Maple is not free. So this is a very nice free alternative in Python. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and hope you learned something. If so, let me know by hitting the like button and leaving a comment in the comment section down below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to not miss a single future video for free. Other than that, thank you much for watching. See you in the next video and bye.